What is up guys? Welcome back to another video. So today's video is kind of an odd one. You see, I have a lot of live streams that have a AC audio in it. I hate the stuff. Honestly, I wish we could literally use PCM audio when it comes to streaming and enjoying ourselves, but we're not allowed to. Unfortunately, PCM audio just takes up too much bandwidth and yeah. So here's the thing. I need to download part three part two and part one of Halo. Now doing this is actually pretty easy with a program that's called J Downloader. J Downloader. And it tends to grab the best quality possible because I stream in 1440p, 18K bitrate, which most people think I'm insane for, but when you got the bandwidth for it, you just gotta give her your best, right? Now here's the thing. I label all my streams like this so I can easily go grab them. There's RA Final, there's me just playing the lost chapters, there's part three and so on and so forth. I've been taking my streams and I've been editing them down so that all of Halo will be in one stream. All of Halo 2 will be in one video, you know, one video, one video, one video, and so on. That way there's just more content for users to go and enjoy. You know what I mean? So this is J Downloader. Now, First thing you want to do is set chunks to 30 and you can also set, you know, downloads to three or two or one. It depends on your workload. Now, here's the thing. I need to go here and copy link. Doing so is going to put it in J Downloader. And now I need part two and copy link. And part three and copy link. Now, once I have all three parts in, I can clearly exit out of this. So we're going to grab part one for starters. Click this button. And there's the audio. Unfortunately, it says you can grab it in MP3 on Windows. But here, Linux, you can't. So we're going to ignore that. Instead, what we're going to do is we're going to grab this. And we're going to do it in MKV. Now, I like MKVs because they're compatible with DaVinci's Resolve. But if you need to use MP4, you can do so. So we're going to hit start download. This is my own video, so I'm allowed to do this. Don't do this with anybody else's video. And you notice that it's not downloading as fast as it should, mainly because it only has one connection. Uh, sometimes you can literally just hit... Where is it? Pause. I believe it's this button. Or just hit stop. And then hit start again. And sometimes it will boost all the way up and be very performant. Now the next part we're going to need the video for, so guess what? I got to wait till this thing is done. It's going to take about 36 minutes, which doesn't seem right. I don't know what's going on with that. My Wi-Fi is disabled. Uh, my wired's there. So I don't know. Maybe this is just not performing the way that it should, which is unfortunate. And I mean, I could reset others, but here's the thing. I want this done quick. So I'm going to download three at a time. They go here. That MKV. Start download. Go to link. They're going to go here. And. Oh, wait, I already got. Where's my link grabber? Okay, so I, I'm already grabbing part one and part two. So I need part three three right here once again we're going to set it to mkv and start download as you can see some are downloading faster than others it's unfair but that's just life so we'll be right back after these are done okay we're going to go through the whole video by the way so you're going to watch me edit the whole thing and i'm going to be doing a thumbnail for it it's going to be a whole process and then we're going to be doing some Zenya video this week so Zenya is an xbox 360 emulator well, it looks like we have a video that is done downloading and doing its thing. I am going to open the download directory, which is right there. My God, it opened in the wrong one. Again, I've been testing things and it's part three that we want. We're going to open a terminal here. Yes, this is something that requires a terminal. Now, In here, we're going to rename this video to Halo 1. Halo 1. Part three. Okay. And because we've opened this up, 
we got to remember the name of that. Now, I actually, believe it or not, need to go to my Discord to remember these commands because it's super, super important. We're going to be using FFmpeg to essentially rip the audio directly. All right, so I'm going to explain this command to you the best that I can. So this is FFmpeg, okay? This is what we're going to be using to rip the audio. This means input. So you're inputting the video and you want to split the audio. And it basically is doing a thing. I don't know what the hell the rest of this means, okay? I'm a simple guy. All right. <laughs> but I'm going to call this, again, Halo 1 uh, Part 3. And we're going to go in here and we're basically going to do Halo yeah, you see, we're hitting the button, but it's not actually doing an autocomplete thing, which is a bit annoying. So what we're going to do instead, is I'm going to get rid of this, and I'm going to drag and drop this video, like that, into the terminal. Now, that could be a bit messy, but if we hit enter, what you'll notice is it's creating an MP3 right there for you. And depending on how fast your computer is, this might take a minute, this might take two minutes, this might take less... Uh, it's basically going to separate the audio for you into an MP3, which is completely workable in DaVinci's Resolve. This is how I managed to do Resident Evil 8. This is how I managed to do Metro Exodus. This is tried and true. This works. And it honestly doesn't take really any time extra at all. You know? So we're going to wait until this is done. And I'll be back when it is. Okay? Okay. All right, so now that this is done, we have a separate MP3 and we have a video, which is nine gigs, kind of big, right? So we're gonna open up DaVinci's Resolve and we're gonna do some things. I have a template that I usually use. It has all my music in it, everything that I need. We're gonna open that up. As you can see, 007 music, Zelda music, Diablo, Random, and Halo. Now, as we only have just these two for now. We're going to put these in there. And the audio. You pull in like this. And it should show up, hopefully, if I did this right. Let's see. Yep. There it is. So that is the entire part three of the live stream. And if we drag this in here. That way, it's perfectly synced when you start editing. Uh, I did some testing of that. I did some dailies here. And we started off right here. And that's important because, well, or that's the loading screen. So I want to start right here. Blam. Get rid of everything else. So there's part three. The audio is synced. The audio is working. You should have no problems from here on out. And I said that we would do the rest of the videos, but unfortunately, it's going to take another couple of minutes for them all to finish. But I will give you one more example. Just one. Again, it opened in the wrong spot. Go to downloads. I need part two. Again, you head in here like this, and we're going to zoom in. There we go. And as you can see, it's not kept because you still have the old one open. But if we do this, what we could do is just copy the command from one point to the other. Like that. And then we open it here. Hit paste here. And we need to turn that to part two. And of course, we're going to get rid of this. We need to input the new file, okay? So this is the new file. We're going to drag and drop that in there. And I'm going to hit enter. And once again, it's going to take everything. It's going to rip the audio to be separate. And as you can see, this is not a hard thing to do. Learning new things is what Linux is all about. Becoming better at certain things is what you do with any operating system. Windows, Linux mac os android ios it all takes a bit of patience and learning to truly get where you need to be and i know this could be 
time consuming for some people to spend a minute separating audio. But when you really think about it, it allows you to get back to your normal workflow. You just have an extra step. Now, I've tried to do this with Handbrake, but unfortunately Handbrake just destroys the audio quality no matter what settings I use. And I find this to be far superior because you get the original quality video and you get the original quality audio without doing anything really. So I'm going to pause so this is done. It's going at 130 times normal speed, which is great. It's using all my threads and cores. I'll be right back. And for the final one, same thing as before. So we're going to set this as part one. And we are going to be getting rid of this entirely. Like that. And then we're going to be dragging the audio in. And hitting enter. So this will be the final video. And then we can just chop it together and make it work. I don't want to really remove anything that's actually important from the video. So uh, we won't be doing that. Because I get that it's ridiculously long. But people can just technically jump in view about five ten minutes of it and realize hey this works pretty good on linux and then skadoodle you know it's like i always say don't ask me if the game works unless i've played it on stream basically go to youtube search the game name plus linux and see what comes up because that's the best way to know if a game works on linux honestly those people on youtube probably know a lot more than the people on proton db do I don't really recommend using ProtonDB unless absolutely dead end necessary and there's no information on the game. Alright, so part 1, 2, and 3 are now all torn apart and are able to be just dragged into DaVinci's Resolve, which I'm going to do right now. Alright, well that's part 3, part 1's in there. I need to go to part 2. All right, so now that we have these parts combined together, uh, if we need to, we can turn these into new compound clips. So that will mean the audio and the video are merged together as a brand new clip. Completely possible. Uh, but for right now, we're going to put part three over there. I'm going to try to bring in part one. Okay, so part one fit. There's part one's audio which is a problem because oh that messed that up so let's try that again oh that's part three again uh where is part one no that's part three and i don't know that's part here we go so this is part one great now, as you can see, it was definitely going to end up overriding uh, everything. So we're going to put that over there. It's hard working with these massive clips. I mean, the size of these things are just gigantic. Knowing me, I probably just... No? Okay, we're good. And uh, where's part two? Great. We're going to lock those in. We're going to lock those in. And that's it. Look at that. We have audio. We have video. And now. I can start this. Perfect. There's probably more to this, but. Probably just loading. I'm going to just cut it right there and delete the rest. Then, I'm going to cut it right there, delete this. Going to see if these are actually combined next to one another, which I doubt they are. What is stopping you? This is a fun part, figuring out why I can't combine these two parts. Yeah, let's do this. There. There we go. So now, 
Blammo. Then we head back here. We find out where this starts. That looks fine. Where are we? Oh yeah, Black Desert Online. Yep. Right there. Blam. And delete. And do a massive 120. There we go. So the entire video has been edited from start to finish. The only thing is... I finished this quite quickly. So... We do this. And... I know I'm not talking as much. Blam. There's silence near the end, which is loud I would like. And now we can just go out. Like that. Problem solved. Not the cleanest thing in the world, but hell, it works. That is all of Halo. That's how you separate the audio. Not that long of a video. Heck, you could have stopped right after I showed you the first time, but if you stay to the end, I very much appreciate it. If you're new here, do not forget to subscribe. we got more content coming this week. I'm going to try to ramp up the videos again and uh, hit the like button, you know, because it helps other people find the, this type of content so they can use Linux easier and they can adjust the workflow. Bye, everybody.